And food delivery drivers are really starting to feel that impact. Yes, indeed they are. CBS 17's Darren Todd did a ride along today with a DoorDash driver to see just what impact these gas prices are having on his daily routine. Darren. Hey, Angela and Rod. Yeah, that's right. Kashanti Mills was such a great guy, and he does, along with a lot of other uh, actually delivery drivers in the area in the Triangle, they deliver a great service. And we had the opportunity to ride along with him today to kind of see how these gas prices are impacting him. And just like other drivers out there, they're looking for some relief at the pumps. Are you trying to get some money on the side, or if you're somebody like me, it's good money, so it's like full time. The recent spike in gas prices has impacted just about everyone, especially those making deliveries. Today, we rode around with full-time DoorDash driver, Kashanta Mills, to get his perspective. So has the recent increase in gas prices impacted your daily uh, dashing? It hasn't as far as like me changing anything. Uh, my attitude is I'm going to spend the same $20 every time I go. And so whatever the gas prices is, it is. I'm going to know it might not last me as long. It might last me longer. But other delivery drivers we spoke to feel differently. It, it's been pretty hard because it's like uh, the DoorDash pay is not really matching up to like the gas prices. According to AAA, the average price for gas in North Carolina is $4.63. And that price is steadily increasing. The DoorDash drivers we spoke with tell us they sometimes calculate the mileage on their vehicles before accepting new orders. You'll probably get like a $2 order, a $3 order to go like nine miles. And it's like, that don't really, you know, help me. It helps DoorDash. You want something that's at least a dollar per mile or, you know, like maybe 12 miles for $10 or nine, you know, something reasonable. With no end in sight to the rising prices, Mill says every tip counts. It makes such a big difference. Like it turns a $3 trip to a $5 trip. Angela and Rod, during that ride along, it actually allowed me to kind of see this hustle and respect this side hustle that he has to do. And it's actually something very special was happening today for Mills. He was actually celebrating his son's sixth birthday. He just turned six today, and he actually wanted to make a lot of money so he can take him out to eat and take him to LeapFrog. Report live here in Raleigh. Darren Todd, CBS 17 News. That is so sweet. Yeah, I hope he did it, too. Thank you, Darren. Thanks, Darren.